hello there how are you i hope all is well and everything is absolutely amazing on your end welcome back on my channel you are listening to light channelings once again and i am back with a mini psychic reading as well as a detailed card reading for all of you before starting with today's messages i'd like to express my gratitude for your help for your support for your love for your appreciation and obviously for your valuable contributions and donations may god bless you with whatever it is that you may need want or wish for for your highest good thank you so much once again for everything now let's jump right into the card reading what it says it says that um, there are certain problems right now that you are experiencing and difficulties coming from other people hence you are unable to get your wishes fulfilled at this point of time but the thing is that universe is saying through way of this cards and is letting you all know that uh, you do not have to worry about it okay because your counterpart is slowly and eventually coming into their power despite the fact that they are surrounded with number of toxic people associations and relationships still they are gaining clarity and divine is helping them to receive clarity about you this connection and everything that's going on in their life i'm seeing number 148 right now okay most of these issues are coming from their family members or the f- group of circle their friend circle they hang out with because these people keep on filling their mind with all kind of toxic traits attributes action plans and they keep on manipulating them into thinking that going with the grain and following the rules of society is the best thing they should be doing and this doesn't resonate with your counterpart at all and that's when they get extremely confused perplexed and puzzled and that's why they feel blank not being able to move forward in any direction so there are people as i said already who are trying to cause blockages problems and obstacles that it deliberately to keep you to apart and ultimately bring an ending in between both of you so that they can win in the situation and be, and feel powerful over and above every thing and everyone but that's not going to happen is what universe is saying whatever problems these people are creating or whatever it is that they are using to manipulate your counterpart into into thinking that moving towards you is not the best choice but listening to them and following their guidelines would be the best choice and decision they are going to make in their life one second i actually forgot what what i was saying i mean that whatever it is it is that these people are using to manipulate your counterpart eventually it's all going to backfire on them and they are going to be shamed for acting and behaving in such a way which is completely regressive 
and toxic in nature these people carry some orthodox ways of living and being and they think that promoting it is the best thing so that they can create their own community and stick to it and by that they are going to somewhere they feel like they are going to lead people by example but that's not the divine plan the divine plan is to bring two divine lovers into union and or reunion which come from different backgrounds different ethnicities different castes cultures skin colors languages i mean they speak different languages and things like that so this is not a traditional kind of a setting here you get my point and that's what universe wants to teach every human being out there that do not limit yourself as love is the most wonderful and powerful thing in this whole universe do not reject people because they are different accept your differences love your differences and love people no matter who they are where they come from what kind of language they speak irrespective of their surnames or skin colors just accept and appreciate each other is what universe wants to teach other people and these people are working against the uni- universe so that's something universe isn't going to tolerate i hope you're getting my point right and that's why these people are going to bear some serious severe karma coming upon them and or over their lives this is what's happening here right now these people are working very very hard to block this connection and bring an ending in between both of you but the good news is your counterpart knows that if they slip into this trap they'll bring an complete ending in between both of you because it has already taken so much time you are focusing on your on your own self on your own growth personal development they can see that possibly through way of social media or by asking your mutual friends or um, some acquaintances both of you know they can see that they are feeling that you are becoming so powerful and so independent day by day that a time will come when you won't even want to be with them and there is no option of need because right now the energy you are operating from or vibrating at is emitting a message or a signal which they are interpreting as that i do not need anyone in my life i am capable i am self sufficient i am independent or i will become capable self sufficient or independent enough to follow my own dreams desires and ambitions i definitely do not need your money validation or approval is what possibly you are projecting out and these people can see that so this is the reason why these people are against you i'm talking about um your opponents here okay these can be anyone i am not using the word karmic or karmics because you know karmic karmics is something who is part of your connection but opposing someone is something that you choose to do so that's why i'm saying these people have chosen to work against you or oppose you right now because they feel threatened by you they do not like what you're doing in your life because they follow the old orthodox ways of living and being and that's what they'd like to promote or carry on but that's not good i'm really sorry for that that's not good that's not part of the divine plan so that's why all of this is happening right now okay so you have opponents here you have some haters i can say like temporary enemies because these uh, some of them are going to 
remain your enemies for lifelong and some of them may change with time who knows divine knows and it will all be revealed to you in divine timing as to what happens next okay but right now what i'm going to say is that you basically do not have anything to worry about because divine is backing you up with a strong divine plan and your team is there dealing with these people and fighting your battles you don't even know nothing about okay your counterpart already knows realizes and understand the beauty of this connection and how much love there is in your life i'm sorry in between both of you towards each other and despite the fact that you guys are not together not even in communication for some of you and there is this um, separation in between both of you the love remains the same and it's growing day by day it's growing day by day okay they can sense that they can feel that and their intuition is making them understand things their rational way of thinking hasn't been able to their habit to find logic in everything is changing with another habit of listening to their intuition because as you are growing healing and evolving in your personal life by default it's happening with them they are following your lead you get my point so right now they are juggling a lot of things they want their family to accept you and respect you they do not want a situation where um, they'd have to make a decision to you know possibly elope with you they do not want that they, they think that that's not something that is going to um bring in happiness in their life or your life they want their wishes to get fulfilled with everyone's blessings that's what they want and i feel like you also want something like that but you know that's that's not going to resonate with each and every one of you so reject that if that doesn't resonate with you or applies to your situation leave that alone it's just um, a energy here that which i'm picking up that's why i explained that they are being very very strategic right now they are collecting facts and figures they are controlling themselves they are fighting with their own inner demons because they know that if they won't regain their own power or if they won't take charge of their own life they're going to mess everything in their life or possibly yours because somewhere they are able to understand and realize you two are connected at such deep levels that their one wrong decision can actually ruin a lot of things in your life a lot of areas i would say not the whole life because what you do with your career and how you handle yourself is still in your own control yes at times outside situations circumstances and external forces play a huge role in what happens next in life but at the end of the day we are in control of how we act behave and react so this is something that's always going to remain in your control as to how you deal with certain situations problems and obstacles but still i'm going to say at times what happens is uh, when we talk about relationships and partnerships other people's free will also plays a very great big role you know in ultimate um in ultimately bringing certain outcomes okay so this is something that uh, you may need to understand with time or make peace with do not put all your eggs in one basket and definitely do not you know put the key of your happiness in your counterpart's pocket or anyone else's overall i'd say that your counterpart your counterpart is really learning a lot of valuable lessons they already regret 
certain decisions and choices they've made in the past which uh, were not a sign of a wise mature confident courageous righteous man or a woman and they feel ashamed of that and that's why right now they are holding strong holding strong to their own faith and they are fighting their own inner demons because they know if they slip this time there won't be any chance of going back they won't be able to undo anything because you have risen to such great levels of uh, spirituality they just can't um one second they can't hide anything from you nothing is you know they won't be able to hide anything from you they can't escape after lying or deceiving you because they know that divine works with you and certain things that are happening right now in their life which is making them understand that everything they are doing thinking or planning is being watched it's like they feel that someone is taking notes of what they are doing thinking feeling or planning does that make any sense to you so basically whatever obstacles are there whether uh, these obstacles actually these are not obstacles people are creating these problems and obstacles for you other people using cultural differences societal differences difference in status difference in color and things like that but what universe is saying is that they won't be able to manipulate the situation or your counterpart using things like these for much longer because a disastrous ending is headed their way as i said already they are going to be shamed and castigated by a lot of people for how they are acting and behaving right now your counterpart doesn't have a lot of helpful people in their life but that's what they are attracting for further growth of this connection and this is going to happen as a way of divine intervention for you and for your connection okay this was all part of the plan these people are go- these people are going to learn their lessons through way of their karma and the new people that are going to enter in your life or the people among these current opponents who are going to have a change of heart will start to work in the favor of this connection that's also something that's written in your divine destinies destinies for a lot of you okay you will have that breakthrough okay your counterpart is going to realize that possibly their mother sister friend colleague boss parents family members are not the greatest kind of individuals they should be listening to or seeking advice or approval from they are going to think a lot about it they are going to ponder over these things and once they receive that 
clarity they'll walk away they leave the situation they won't listen to any of those people and what they have to say or what others are going to say if they are using what people are going to say about us and our family and our relationship relationships or friendships they won't pay much attention to all of these things but it's it's going to happen with time not outrightly i am going to say that to you right away right now okay there is lot of hate lot of jealousy lot of envy lot of you know cynical people either in your or your counterparts life or just around you who are going to create a lot of trouble for both of you if you do come together right now and if that's not the case i feel like somewhere your own unhealed issues and problems are going to become a very big huge obstacle for both of you because i feel like still there is this need of control and you know this need to dominate another person and win over another person i feel like if you guys come back together at this current present moment of time you may end up having some really ugly fights or arguments with each other that's why this is not happening right now and that's my that's why maybe universe is saying that maybe you guys need to heal even more you need to let go of the you need to let go of that anger that resentment those grudges you're holding on to and even if these grudges are not against your counterpart but for other people who have done you really really wrong maybe that energy needs to get cleared away first and i think that's why universe is also telling you to you know control your emotions control your anger control your outbursts if you've made it a habit of bursting out out of anger or rage you need to control that because you know you will have that new beginning they will leave that unhealthy situation or those unhealthy connections but it's going to happen with time universe is going universe is going to put everyone who is working against you in their place they are going to get whipped out of your lives but in divine timing okay your angels your guides your ascended master the whole universe is working in your favor and let me tell you something what these people have done to you their karma is like you know five times or three times worse than that the people they are going to attract or are attracting right now in their life who are going, who are going to teach them certain lessons they are going to be worse kind of individuals worse than them what they did to you is nothing in front of what's going to happen with these people is what universe is saying but still you need to let go of holding on to that energy of uh, you know where you think at times that i want to get even with these people or i want to see them getting the taste of their own medicine it's going to happen but still universe has a message to tell you that you you need not harbor hate resentment or anger in your life instead you should remain focused on what it is that you want you should remain focused on your own love energy you should operate from your heart space i'm seeing number 66 right now so these are the few things which universe had in store to let you all know 
right now your counterpart feels threatened actually i'm trying to reiterate and summarize everything for you your counterpart realizes and understands everything slowly and eventually the clarity is coming in worry not about other things that are blocking this connection especially if it's their parents or family members who are creating obstacles and problems because they do not they do not want you two to get married or come back together and they are using certain things like culture caste tradition religion skin color or whatever it is silly petty issues it won't work ultimately you are going to reunite and get married because that's the divine plan and that's going to change a lot of things for other humans and people are going to learn by you and from your example everyone is going to envy your new beginning because it's going to look so bright and so beautiful people are going to gossip about you they would want to know how you attracted all of these things and that's how you're going to learn and teach a lot of people about divinity about love about relationships and the power of universe and love and just all of that so yes uh, i feel like we've stretched a lot today into this reading but i think that it was needed and uh, you did enjoy listening to me or you already did if that's what happened do let me know in the comment section below drop a loving drop a loving comment or you know subscribe to my channel or just hit the like button with that being said if you'd like to contribute donate or show your appreciation feel free to follow the link given in the description box below that's all for now i'll be back again till that time please take care of yourself and your loved ones bye bye